had this bag for years. It's been to Antarctica with me back in 2009. It's been to Africa with me back in, I think, 98. And now we just kind of store it. It's an extra bag in case we had to fly, but it's uh, always stored underneath our trailer or behind the truck. And it seems to gather the most amount of dangerous things that live um, in the wild in it. So if you're a big, big, scary spider, snake, scorpion, you'll probably be in that bag if you want to live underneath the trailer. Ooh, something just touched my toe. I'm all jumpy. If you can't tell, just remove like a spider like that big from it. Melissa suggested I put gloves on. And maybe a helmet, so we'd have to look for um, a big helmet. We're packing up today. We're moving on. It's a uh, lovely spot. Coming close up to our 14 day limit, so it's time. <coughs> Here's our a new friend over here. Look at your lover, Haley. Oh, <coughs> Melissa is peeling <coughs> eggs. Oh, and Haley is very, very you just mock charge, didn't you? Yeah, she's like, my egg. And Mara. Come here, little girl. Wow. Oh, Amara's going to pee on your trailer, Haley, if you keep up that bitchiness. Amara, come here. Whoa, whoa. Oh, my. Oh, Amara, you're hungry, huh? Good girl. I'm just messing with Haley. I'm just messing with Haley. Amara, you want to see if there's anything living in this bag? That's right. That's what we're doing. So, um, anything else living in this bag? With the spider that was in there, I think they're pretty territorial. It's probably the only living item. The only reason there is something in here. Oh my goodness, Amara, you scared me. I thought you were a big scorpion that jumped out. Just, I just got licked in the face by Amara. I'm a little too jumpy. Okay, let's see what else. What else? What else is in here? Yep, yeah, we got this citrus cleaning solution that we've never used. Could we use vinegar instead? Okay, there's something white in there, but it looks like bone. Eggs. Oh, the spider eggs. You should probably move the spider eggs. Tell me what it is. Okay. I don't know what that is. It looks like rock almost. Yeah, it looks like a rock. <laughs> okay. Well, I think we're relatively safe. There could be stuff underneath here. That's the only fear I have now. Because there's so many different layers to this bag. But I think we're going to risk it. I think we're going to let it be. We're going to uh, say this, it's just going to gather more creepy crawlies because we're staying in the state. For a moving state, I wouldn't want to move wild animals maybe um, somewhere else and, and you know, introduce them. But we're staying in this area. We're actually doing something really secret. I don't know if I want to tell you. Hmm. I don't know yet. I think I will tell you, but not in this video. That's what's next. Okay. Let's go to inspect Haley's dog food. <laughs> She's eating enough human food. Let's make sure things you have to do with dogs to make friends every day. You never know who they're going to meet. So they just made a new friend. And new friends tend to feed Haley because she's an ultimate beggar. She always wonders why we inspect her food. First, we check for consistency. <laughs> Partial 
special burrito. A little bit of burrito, a little <laughs> corn, a little flax seed. Usually you wouldn't see flax seed, but people on the road, I tend to see a lot of seeds in their Mexican food like that. Um, I think we're comfortable with that dog poop. Um, everyone's going to ask if I pick up my dog poop most of the time. If we're really, really remote and it's at a campsite, I leave it. Um, if you look around, we actually have been burning cow patties to keep the flies away. So um, there's enough animals here that don't belong. And uh, it doesn't seem to disturb the amount of wildlife we've seen around us. We wake up and there's, we're surrounded by rabbits. So that's because Haley's inside. So it's going to go back into the earth anyways. But I do inspect it, yes. And Melissa is a pro inspector as well. I'd like to interview her one day on her feedback on what she would give you on how good poop is, the health of your dog. Right, the health lady. of your dog? Where's Amara? She went home. Amara just came to visit, and then guess what, Haley? You scared her off. The love of your life. Alrighty, I'm gonna shut it off.